YouTube land, what is up? It is Frank with What's the Point EDC, and I got another unboxing. All right, so I went to the knife store to grab a knife, and as I do every time, I end up coming out with a different one than I end up going in for. Anyway, so I went in there, and I was uh, looking at some knives, and I seen the name Honey Badger on the grip scale. So I went ahead and grabbed it. It's the HB1031. There you go, everybody. It's the case right here. I'm going to go ahead and open it up. So there's a little tool right here. Get that out the way. <clears throat> Alright, so I found out about... That's nice. So I just seen it and told him to go ahead and put it in, uh, in the bag. I'll just go ahead and take it. So the first time I heard about Honey Badger knives was through the saw grunt. That's a great dude, a great channel. You guys should check him out. He throws knives, he throws axes, he throws everything. He's got a lot of content. He puts stuff out daily. He's always got great knives. And trust me, he's got a saw collection. All right, so um, to this here knife, it's got 8CR13 MOV steel. It's got FRN scales, deep carry pocket clip. So the name of the knife I forgot to say is called the Warren Cleaver. I'm sure you guys kind of get the reason why. Flipper tab. It does have a little bit of lock stick. Listen. Hold on. Go to you again. Yeah, that was a good one. But it's okay. It's not a big deal. It's just it's a budget knife and it probably needs broken in. I haven't opened it up. So I did wipe it off before I put it on camera because there was a little bit of oil here and a little bit of oil on the blade, which it's cool. I don't mind that. It's protection. So I'll go ahead and slap a couple knives beside it real quick just so you guys can get a quite little comparison. This is just an unboxing, nothing serious. Bada bing, bada bang. Okay. Go ahead and give them the old flip flop for you guys. I know you guys want that. So this is running on bearings. <clears throat> Stainless liners. Um, Like I said, I really don't know anything about the company itself at all. Nothing. Uh... Actually, I'm going to do some researching on it. Um, this was only 37 bucks. It's got a satin finish. The handle length is, uh, I think it's four and a half inches. It's an eight inch knife, so it's got about three and a half inch blade then. Um, I got it at Edgeworks in Frederick, Maryland. Great company. You guys should definitely give them a call. Check their website. It's Edgeworks Knife and Supply. They are a solid company. Great dudes. Okay, there's one thing I want to say real quick while I'm thinking about it, and that's if you're an addict, never quit quitting. Life gets better. Stay strong and live long, guys. Never give up. So this right here was just a quick little showing right here. It's nothing serious. I just wanted to give the saw grunt a good shout out. The dude deserves it. I wouldn't have known about the company were it not been for him. Check his content out. There's more shout outs to come, more knives to come. Stay tuned, everybody, and I'm glad I got this. Much love. Peace.